<laughs> I don't care much for that woman, though. I suppose I should offer my thanks. After all, she has given me the perfect opportunity to dispose of the two of you rejects. <laughs> dispose of us? I was thinking the same thing about you. I can finally crush you with my two bare hands. Very well, then, if you wish to die that badly. Wait a sec! What do you want? Kakarot, stay out of this! Who says you get to fight first, Vegeta? It's not fair! Nobody cares! Quit bothering me! You got in my way the last time we fought Frieza, in case you don't remember. Yeah, well, sorry about that, but if you'll remember, I didn't have much of a choice. Whatever, just stay out of my way, and we'll call it even. Well, technically I saved you earlier, so aren't we already even? When you were knocked out and Frieza tried to attack you, I blocked the attack and saved you. Shut up! Why do you always bring that up? Now if you're done trying to steal my moment of glory, I have a fight to get to. Jeez, no need to be so moody, Vegeta. Just let me fight Frieza for a little bit, okay? Cool? A bit? Do I look stupid? Just let me fight! That is enough! You have some nerve making me listen to this juvenile squabbling! That's something I seriously cannot stand about the two of you mindless monkeys! If you two want to fight me so badly, then I'll just destroy you both at the same time! I'll crush the two of you with my bare hands! yourself for the coming battle! for the coming battle! of 1 to 100, I'd give it a 24. Those Ginyu losers aren't packing much power either, at least not from what I heard. Well, K-1 
can't be too picky. And you, why watch from the back row? I'll give you a VIP seat. Oh, so you knew all along. Of course. Why do you think I let you watch me maul that meathead? Consider that a preview of what's gonna happen to you. <laughs> Aren't you excited? <laughs> You're going to have a much harder time if you plan on snacking on me. Though, from the looks of it, you've been snacking a bit much as it is. You should probably dial it back a bit. You wouldn't want a bellyache now, would you? You look tastier than... who was that? Oh yes, Nappa. <laughs> I wonder what I should turn you into. What the... Don't worry, I'll be sure to make it quick. How did you get this strong, this fast? When we last angled, I wasn't even at half power. I'd like to actually try this time, if that's okay. So let's set the table. It's time to eat! So, Boo, you don't turn people into candy and eat them anymore? So, promise Mr. Satan no more turning people into candy! Mr. Satan, give Boo lots of treats and no more people into candy! Haha! <laughs> jealous? Not really. Definitely nothing to be jealous of. I eat yummy candy every day, so much that I'm sick of it. I get way more candy than you. Loads more. No way! Mr. Satan get Boo more! Nuh-uh! I have more candy. Mr. Satan! Me! What are you doing? Stop messing around! Fine! <laughs> you got in trouble! You got in trouble! No fair! You started it! I'll get you back by destroying lots of enemies and making you look bad! Time to begin the match! Gohan, I was told that you have been training with Piccolo. Have you regained your ability to fight? 
Well, I think I've improved quite a bit since the time Frieza came back. Not good enough. All this peace has made you lazy and soft. If you want to call yourself a Saiyan, then toughen up and act like one! You say that you're training again, but I haven't seen any proof of that! What? Really? I'm taking my training seriously, though. If that's true, then you're better off without softy trainers like Piccolo and Kakarot! Well, Vegeta, if that's how you feel, why don't you train me? Who, me? Don't be ridiculous! You can go and train yourself! You know, in some ways, you're more brutal than Piccolo used to be. Enough of this! It's time to fight! The outcome of this fight is anybody's guess! Good either. I'd probably give it a solid 40. Still, it's a long ways from Cell, though. Hold on. You made Cell into a bonbon. That explains your dramatic increase in power. Bug Boy deserved it. The perfect organism, more like perfect pinhead. Oh, try not to be too hard on him. He did try his best, after all. Sadly, no amount of effort can make him understand that he was weak. Speaking of which, you're not that special yourself. You can actually crack a joke. I see your programming does extend beyond pigging out. I will have you know that I don't pig out. I'm simply blessed with a discerning palate. Good. Now that we have that cleared up, I think I'd like to eat you now. One moment. Scratch that. No. Your jokes are horrible! You'll just have to work your second hand! Is that all such a letdown? What? It's time to eat! <laughs> That's delicious! Clones can't beat the real deal! Go organic! So fresh and flavorful! This is the best I've had yet! I'm going to give it an 80! I believe that it's time to check in on Goku and friends! Appears they managed to wake up Vegeta. And I see they're rounding up their friends to try and beat me. I was hoping to scarf them down while they couldn't move, but this way works too. After all, food is much better when it is served fresh. Oh, 
I can almost taste them. Patience now, patience. I've already waited this long. They need to get stronger, and then, then the feasting can begin. Their power writhing and screams. Ah, the perfect seasoning for the perfect meal. to fight together but wait what exactly should I call these guys so Goten's dad is just Goku to Trunks and Trunks dad is just Vegeta to Goten so huh. hey what do you think I should call you two huh you're asking me about this? You're big, so you should help us figure this out. Hmm, that's a toughie. Okay, I'm Goten's dad, but I'm not Trunks' dad, so... Hey, Vegeta, what do you think? Don't like I care. Quit wasting my time with such nonsense. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> now you've gone and done it. You too, Kakarot! This isn't the time to relax, idiot! S sorry Vegeta, jeez! Fool, just focus on the enemy in front of you! It's time to face your opponent! 